hello everybody this is noob crafter here and I'm going to do my first minecraft tutorial first of all click single player notice here these are my three already rendered worlds but for this video I'm going to create a new world here in the world name you can just type whatever you want in the name world uh, I'm going to t call this tutorial world and the seeds this is more like uh, and not random randomization uh, we're not being we're not going to use this for now generating level give it a second Here we go. It's quite a nice world. You can see the blocks being generated, rendered in the distance. Half a tree over there, and all the jazz. jazz. We have a beautiful cave here with some iron ore. First thing you've got to do in Minecraft when you first render the world is get yourself some wood just click and hold and you got some wood yay there's the wood this is the inventory i pressed i to get the screen i and there we go but at least we have to start with let's say three or four wooden blocks and we'll be okay let's make it five Uh, you can see this tree is suspended in air, but uh, it's actually going going away slowly because I took all the trunk away, and it's dropping uh, these things. These are uh, saplings. You can place them wherever you want on grass anyway. One there. And within three Minecraft days, they'll be gr they grow big like these trees. Yeah. Uh, first thing you want to do in Minecraft is crafting a workbench. It, uh, to craft a workbench, we need uh, four planks, wooden planks. To get wooden planks, just place the wood in the crafting gizmo, whatever, and you get four wooden planks. And to make the workbench, just place these four, click on it, and you've got it. Place it in a corner somewhere like there. Uh, this is going to be my first home here. Uh, so, uh, let's do this quickly. Wooden planks, we need lots of wooden planks. And now, I'm going to make some sticks. Sticks are used to, whoops, to create tools and things. And let's make a pickaxe, wooden pickaxe, and a wooden axe. It's like drawing the stuff. It works other way around. I think. Yep, wooden axe. Yeah. What we need to do now is get some rock there's the rock in my hand hey. at least three for now to get myself a rock pickaxe rock tools mine things faster than wooden tools and their dur durability is much stronger. Now I'm gonna get as much uh, rock as I can from here so I can uh, cover this up because baddies will come and they do come at night. So let's see what time it is. The sun I think is going that way. 
yes and it's like high low we've got time we've got time but we've got to do it fast as fast as we can Harder than I thought. So barricade this entire cave. So now plan B. Just build from scratch. We don't need to build too big at first. This is quite okay. Four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Four. There is an opening for the door, and like this. Oh, I'm out of wood. Ow. Rock. So get more rock quickly. Uh, it's actually a bit repetitive in the beginning mining for rock but then we can get the other things like uh, diamond gold I'll show you how to get those in a future video if I get enough feedback from you guys I'm out of rock again. Let's get like fifty or something. Which one is good? It's a good number. Okay, jump, 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 jump around. Yeah, sorry guys, I won't be doing that again. Now, uh, three blocks high is good. Ow, I fell. I'm gonna get some sand. Put a temporary staircase here so I can reach up there and place my blocks. Yep, there we go. Uh -huh. Three blocks high, and now the ceiling. Eleven, I think it's enough. Oh, nearly enough. Yeah, you can see this hole. Uh, Beddies can get through it. So now, I think I still have some wooden planks, just enough make a wooden door and that's how you make wooden door it will work exactly the same the other way around and yeah never forget your furniture outside because it won't help uh -huh. there we go there we go When placing a door, uh, place it from outside because when you're inside, you can hit uh, hitting, let's say, a zombie from inside. But when it's placed from within inside, uh, you, you can't hit anything. So it opens the door and uh, messes things up. 
it's good to get messy in the dark in this game. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna poke some holes here in the ceiling. So I still get some light, given that I don't have any torches at the moment. And this way, but he still can't come in. And uh, I get some moonlight, which is really helpful. And we're just in time for sunset. This is sunset, some clouds, and it's time to go back in. So, uh, poke a hole here to see outside. It's gonna be a window. Uh, make sure you don't stay in line of fire of from uh, uh, skeletons. Skeletons carry uh, firearms, uh, bow and arrow, and you don't want to get stay here while they're shooting at you. So we're gonna kick back and wait for tomorrow. Uh, while waiting, so. So I don't get too bored in this game. I'm gonna make a mine here. Start with hand. And yeah, there. When you're mining you wanna make some kind of steps. Stepping stone, I guess. Like step down, step down, remove this. Remove that. And and step down. Cobblestone. Ooh, I don't want that. Okay, we've got to wait till morning so that buddies don't come through here. I just poked a hole in my house. Yeah, that's that's really good. <laughs> Sorry about that. So, uh, I'm going to end this first tutorial here. Uh, mainly, the rest of the night consists of hiding and stuff. Uh, have a nice day. Free, feel free to post comments and and like this video or dislike if you want to. Thanks very much for watching, this is Noobcrafter here, bye bye.